Well, we got a swarm out here. I thought they were done swarming. Daggone it. I thought I heard them out here. I wonder which hive they're coming out of. Oh, well, that's pretty obvious. Yeah, this hive was jamming with bees. So here's what a swarm looks like. Oh, there's the queen. Oh, she just went in. I don't know if you saw that on video. The queen went back in, so they may they may abort. Let's see if we see her come out. Now, Kent Williams told me the queens don't want to leave. The workers kick them out. <laughs> Let's see if we see her come out here. Wow, she was crawling around on the board. I didn't notice. I can't wait to rewatch this video and see if I can spot her. You all may be able to spot her. That was cool. Perfect timing. Let's see if she comes back out. She's like, heck no, I don't want to go anywhere. This colony is jammed with bees, so I'm not surprised. They've been, I've got three supers on this colony because they've been packing away honey like there's no tomorrow. Hmm. Well, there's tons of bees airborne. Oh. Yeah, she went back in, so I'm curious to see what this swarm's going to do. And that certainly looked like a Maida queen. She wasn't marked. And I'm pretty sure I had a marked queen in this colony. May, as many bees that are coming out, bees are going back in, so I don't know. They may abort. They're like, hey, where's, where's the queen? Where'd she go? <laughs> she snuck back inside. <laughs> uh, curious where they're going to decide to land. I think we have another swarm going on over here. Sure looks like it. Or... Lord, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, they're swarming too. Come on, stop swarming. And this stinks because this is the colony that has the simple comb on it. There's plenty of space up there though. I mean, again, you, you kind of take the good with the bad with this the one downside I've noticed with this single brood management you just get lots of swarming so but just deal with it okay this is not what I wanted to do today I'm installing uh, two swarms from the uh, swarm trap that's what I need to be doing uh, looks like they're landing over on that spot again man I wish they would have chosen a, a spot that's not so high they really like that spot over there. Looks like that's where they're gonna settle on. This one over here though may be aborting. Cause that queen went back in, so. Oh well. We'll see where they land, but it sure looks like it's gonna be up there again. Cause I see them all flying up there. And that's just too high for me to get. They were doing such a good job at choosing uh, <laughs> lower spots. Okay, well, enough of these crazy bees. Got to get back to the task at hand. So, yeah. Looks like she's landed right up there on that branch, I would say. It's just too high. I don't even think I can reach that with a pole saw. Thousands of bees. been a great year though i mean the flow and the weather's cooperated that's why there's so many swarms we've had good luck getting bees made or getting queens mated and returning back so all right beautiful day like today it was inevitable that there was going to be a swarm or two i was just hoping my girls were mostly done with this 
All right, let's go get that trap. Uh, let's go get that swarm out of that trap. Well, it's the best idea I could come up with. I got the swarm out of this swarm trap. Put a couple of sprays of swarm commander in there, and I'm hoping it works like a Russian sky on, I think they call it, where that swarm decides to come down. It's covered in bees. I think it's just the field bees. But hopefully there's some scout bees that find it. Uh, Cause that's, that's a huge swarm. I'll show you a close up. What is that like 40 feet, 40 feet up in the air or so? I mean, that's a big swarm. That's a shame. I mean, there was thousands of bees flying in the air. I just, I have a long pole. I just don't have a, if anybody has any ideas on a good way to fashion a five gallon bucket to an extension pole, like, let me know. Cause I've been looking for a piece of hardware or something that I could use. Um, Cause I'm pretty sure I could, I could shake them into a five gallon bucket, but hopefully, hopefully they find this. We'll see.